sustainable conservation is an environmental nonprofit, and our mission is to partner with business, agriculture, and other stakeholders to find environmental solutions that make economic sense. Sustainable conservation has a long track record of promoting practices and technologies that improve water quality, and we wanted to leverage the strong partnerships we have in the agricultural sector to uh, look at water quantity issues. We had sort of thought about the water quantity issues as being dominated by all that you hear in the press around the contentious issues around the Delta and the San Joaquin River. But we realized that while there are a lot of groups working at that level on water in California, there are very few working at the farmscape level. And this is really important for California because agriculture uses 75% of the water in the state. And if we're going to support California's growing population, maintain a thriving agricultural sector, and support salmon and other species, agriculture has to use water more efficiently. Before SV2 came along, we had done a six-month study trying to identify what were promising technologies and practices, and SV2 came along right at the right time because it enabled us to basically implement the strategic plan we had developed. Sustainable conservation was a perfect grantee for us. They are very, very focused on results, so they pick projects where you can measure what they are going to do and they deliver results. So for us, it was a very easy decision. We're working with a farmer named Russ Lester, who is exactly the kind of uh, innovator and early adopter we love to work with. This particular orchard had been in flood irrigation before. He was traveling in Italy and saw this upside-down sprinkler system. And and this uh, system saved him 80% water use. We're looking actually at an, an additional tweak he can make on the system to make it even more efficient. And then assuming that that is all positive, we will work with him to promote that uh, throughout California. We figure if we could save even 5% of their applied water they're using, that's the equivalent to 200,000 acre feet, which is about what 400,000 uh, homes use, or if you think about it, it's about the equivalent of half of Hetch Hetchy's uh, capacity. So it would make a really significant difference. I really want to thank SV2 for making this possible because it was definitely a risk. This was a new area for sustainable conservation and while we had track record on water quality issues, we had never done water quantity. It's a much more contentious field, obviously, and we really appreciate that SV2 was willing to take the risk to allow us to experiment in this area and I think really launch what's going to be a very powerful program for sustainable conservation and have a great impact for California.